Hi, this lesson focuses on our motto exercises during this failure management process. Exercises to engage the patient include facial exercises, jaw exercise, lips exercise, tongue exercise, among others. During facial exercise, ask the patient to puff up cheek, hold the hair for 5 seconds without allowing the hair to escape, then slowly release the hair. Exercise 2. Suck in cheek. During this process, ask patient to suck in cheek, hold for 5 seconds, then gradually release the cheek. These tend to promote voluntary swallowing process. Third exercise, pop up cheek with hair. During this process, ask patient to suck in hair with the mouth open and immediately seal the lips. Encourage the patient to move the hair from right side of the cheek to the left side five to 10 times. During this process, Ask patient to breathe through the nose while performing this exercise. The next exercise is to ask the patient to raise, raise the eyebrow. eyebrow. During this process, pay attention to the forehead wrinkles while the patient maintains this position for 60 seconds. Follow this exercise with alternate eye closing. In this case, you ask the patient to close one eye tightly while opening the other. Alternate this for 5 to 10 times. The eye must be closed tightly while patient maintains the position for some certain time. Our motto exercise 2. Jaw exercise. 1. Ask the patient to open the mouth far wide as much as possible, hold for 60 seconds, and close tightly. To close jaw, tap on the bucinator muscle to be sure that patient apply enough pressure. Exercise 2. Ask the patient to drop down the jaw as far as possible. With the head in neutral position, avoid forward flexion or extension of the neck during this process. The next exercise is to request the patient to move the jaw from side to side for 5 to 10 times. The next exercise is to move the jaw forward and backward. During this process, pay attention on the temporal mandibular joint movement. In case of spastic patient, you can facilitate this process by placing one finger behind the temporal mandibular joint and one on the anterior surface of the mandible. Passively rock the joint forward and backward for facilitatory process, as you have seen in this video. Follow this exercise with sounds that give broad movement of the jaw, such as we. Why? 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 Third, lips exercises. Ask the patient to pronounce ho with an elongation and the lips forward. Hold this position for 60 seconds, then relax. Follow this with Eh, with the leaves backward, hold the position for 60 seconds, then relax. Alternate the sound O and E eh, for 60 seconds. Next activity, lips tucked in. During this process, Act patient to tuck in the lower lips, hold for 60 seconds, follow this with alternate pout and smile for 10 times. Complete this exercise with face poker. During this process, ask patient to move the cheek from side to side, 
open mouth wide with the face remain poker. This exercise is ideal for a patient with hypotonicity in the oral musculature. 4. Tongue exercises. For this lesson, observe the demonstrations. Other activities include voluntary tongue retraction with the mouth closed, yawning with forward, backward elevation and depression of the tongue, followed by gaggling. This can be practiced with saliva and if patient is perfect enough, water or other liquid substance can as well be used.